name is Richard John. I'm the Prefone architect in Intel. Today I'm going to show you how we can use Intel FPGA functioning as a deep learning accelerator in the video end-to-end -end solution. As you can see that we have three different boxes running different you know, workloads. Part of them are deep learning based, part of them are traditional. So uh, let's go through uh, this demo first. So here we have an i7 system connecting to a webcam, taking a live video, and we are doing face detection and the, uh, landmark detection algorithms. And uh, the, uh, we actually crop the faces and send it to the middle one, that is the NVR system. We have the core i i5 and APJ cards to uh, uh, to perform the face feature extractions. And once you know each face has been converted to four kilobyte of data, we will send it to the backend server here. So the backend server today we have 20 million of faces, and we can actually achieve you know um, to find one face among 20 million faces within 20 milliseconds. We also have the obtain disk installed in this server, so uh, we can actually cut the memory cost in half. Uh, at the same time, we can achieve almost 80 or 85 percent of performance as DDI has. So let's you know, start from this screen. So if I look at the camera, you can see that uh, the face detection and landmark detection on, on one you know, processor actually run at 500 frames per second. And, uh, those pictures will be sent to the MVR system. So uh, if we go this way, we can see that once OpenVINO start running, uh, we can you know, um, start you know, running cropped face here. And uh, we can you know, convert each face into a feature vector at 120 frames per second. And each face will be sent to uh, this server. So if you look at this screen, you can see that uh, the system actually can find my face among 20 million faces within 15 milliseconds. So um, this is how you know, flexible that Intel want to provide you to do the deep learning workload and also to create an uh, end-to-end solution and you can actually deploy your uh, deep learning model to different boxes. Um, if you need more information, please you know, uh, look at the Intel website and thank you for watching.